morning, M. Wayne family. Uh, it's Thursday, and here's a thought that has been sitting on my mind for the past week uh, in relation to the crazy looting, uprising protests uh, that has been happening in South Africa and all the protests um, that have been happening all over the world uh, due to various various conflicts, various uh, unhappiness, various sort of tribal conflict, um, whether it comes to moral um, misunderstandings with the government, with the current leaders of the countries that the current generations are uh, experiencing unhappiness in, or whether it be the corruption that is being exposed all over the world. Um, I think it's safe to say I've been saying this over and over on MYN uh, and various other platforms that we are in a contractual phase of uh, existence right now. Um, moving back to tribe, uh, we've seen how people need to just look after themselves and how uh, in South Africa we've come to protect uh, our communities uh, in the wake of these uh, crazy looting sprees that have been happening. So how today... The thought that I want to leave you with or allow you to ponder is how today can you better serve your tribe, whether it be your family tribe, your community tribe, um, or your spiritual tribe? How can you facilitate and support members of that tribe better? Because we know and we are clearly uh, understanding now how much people are in desperate need of just basic, basic support. If you feed people, keep them warm, give them, you know, an, an opportunity or the environment to exercise their, their, their desires in, whether it be in the work or creative fields, then you won't have this crisis. And we know that um, governments are not able to uh, facilitate this peace environment. So how can we better do it? How can we better facilitate those around us to allow them peace, which will then in turn allow us peace?